guys, uh, welcome back. Today we're going to do a Dora the Explorer cake. And I've just found an image online that I liked. And I have printed it out. And I've just kind of cut around it. I'm going to, or I am, taping it to a movable surface that I can put in it and out of the freezer. Okay? And we're going to do a frozen buttercream transfer. Okay? And, um... Now I'm just going to take some see-through paper, wax paper is what I'm using, and we are going to just basically uh, tape that down over our image, and we are going to pipe icing on top of this wax paper, and we're going to need to place it in the freezer just to let it set up and harden so that we can work with it and then we're going to place it on the cake. I have a whole bunch of these on my channel. If you'd like to see more, I have Snoopy, um, I have Cars, I have Winnie the Pooh. Okay guys, so I have Dora. She's ready to go and now I just have my icing bag and I have a tip number two okay and I'm just going to outline pretty much everything at this point okay we can start on her hair and you're gonna do this for the entire picture Okay, now, um, I get a lot of people who want me to show the whole process, so that's kind of what I'm going to do at this point. <clears throat> and I do take my time as you can see just so that my lines are neater and it comes out better so I'm going to go ahead and pull you guys away for a while I'm going to outline a little bit more of this and then I'll bring you back and show you where we're at okay, so for the most part um, I've gotten all the brown areas outlined Okay, if I've missed any lines, that is because I'm probably going to add them in with a different color or not add them at all. <clears throat> okay, and now I'm just going through here and I am filling up sections of her hair. And I'm just doing small little sections at a time because my tip is small and I really don't want to change out the tip right this second okay and I'm going to continue her hair and then we'll start on another color and we'll be back okay guys so there's her hair I still have not uh, placed this in the freezer yet first I'm going to go ahead and fill in all of the little white areas which would be her eyes
Okay, and then her little shoes. And I'm using a very fine tip just because these are smaller areas and I want to make sure to get all the detail. Um, <clears throat> and then one more little shoe. Make sure to keep your tip out of the icing or you're going to dry colors around and you don't want to do that, especially if it's not frozen. So there is our shoes and our eyes and um, she does have one more little spot in her eye and it's a little white little spot so we're going to go ahead and just face that one. My little one's upset so... I'm going to place those down. We're going to go ahead and pop her in the freezer for a few minutes and we will be back. Alright guys, so now we're just going to do the little yellow of her socks. And I just have a very teeny tiny bit of yellow. So we're going to do her socks and then we're going to do her bracelet. and her bracelet can be a bit difficult because they're little pearls and I didn't outline these that's okay I'm just going to do little dots just like that okay so all the yellow is done all the white's done and the darker brown is done we have purple and a dark blue and the orange of her shirt and then her skin color and her tongue and then her eyes <laughs> we got a lot to do so we'll be back guys now we're going to do her shorts um i did an orange color in my bag and now i'm just going to pipe it You just want to make sure that you fill in all the holes. This is a real quick easy way to do pretty much any character and get really good results. All you're doing is tracing. So we have her shorts done. Um, we'll come back and I uh, will do another portion. Right now we're going to place her in the freezer and we'll be back. Hey guys, so there is Dora. We filled out the rest of our template. Um, if you want to see how to do that in depth, I have several of those on my channel. Go and search those. We placed her on top of the cake and added a trim. Don't forget guys, share me on Facebook and Twitter with all your friends and family. I appreciate all the great support rate the video, stop by my Facebook page and uh, like that as well. I do have some things there that I don't show here on YouTube.
Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. i got some great ideas coming up as well. And as always, guys, thanks so much for watching.